Oh my god, that is so cursed. But you no, know what? The good news is that I can find things like ores more easily. That is so cursed. Why does it have to be so cursed? That's so weird. <laughs> What's going on guys? It's me, David from Reviews What I Say, and today we have Minecraft. You might be wondering, why are we on 21W15A? That's like a lot of times after that. Why is the title screen different? All of these questions I'm about to answer. So basically, Mojang just announced that um, they're going to be splitting 1.17 into two parts. The summer update is now not going to have all those cool new caves, and it's just going to have all these new blocks and stuff. So, like the geodes, they're staying. Like all the new texture, the ore textures, they're staying. Raw ores, yep, they're staying. However, the ca new caves are going to be switched to be in the winter update, meaning that for the time being, we still get to play our thing. So we can go to our hardcore world now, meaning we are at part 7 at last. And we can, uh, and I can show you a bunch of the new features, because... Boy, there have been a lot of new features since. And I mean a lot. I mean, what can I say? It's been 10 weeks. They only removed the new caves. In fact, let me just go into here. And looking into the furnaces, yeah, okay. Let's see if I have any of the ore blocks. No, not, unfortunately not. Because that would been really cool. So, first of all, I'm going to be going down into the mines. Just to show you some of the new and cool stuff. Because this is also going to be like a showcase of everything new. And you'll immediately be able to tell when everything is new. Like, as you can see, the coal texture... That is different. The copper texture, it's also different. Over here, like, look at this big circle of things. Everything is different. It's really cool. I love how they made all these amazing changes to the game. As I expect more cool features to come. So, also, we live near a mountain, meaning I get to showcase our new mob, the goat. Yes, they are adding the lovable goat into Minecraft. And since this is in, like, a mountainous area, we should be finding one over there. I just need to make sure I had a bed, and I don't think I have a bed, so let me just... Get my shears, and we shall go, go, go. Alrighty. No, I don't mind having a black bed, so I'll deal with having to shear you. Yes! All three, so we'll have a gray bed. Nice. Just realize how different these colors are. Anyway, we're going to be... Making the trek up there, and we'll be greeting our new goat friends. So, just keep on trying to do this. Mm. And then we'll go mining to show you some more of the new features. And then we'll actually try to do something new, because, like, I feel like there's something missing here, like, I don't know what it is. It just feels like something's missing from the series. Also, it's time I eat, uh, I eat some bread. <clears throat> okay, already. So, I'm just 
continuing to get up here and let's try to find the new goat mob. And I've, I haven't really climbed this mountain yet, so this is going to be pretty cool. Look at this, we're at the clouds. The clouds. How do, how am I supposed to survive up here? Like, what? Ow. <sighs> Gotta remember, this is hardcore. If I die, it's over. So. Let's MLG this. Yes! I am LG water bucketed it. However you say it. So let's just continue looking around. Despite the fact that they cancelled the new mountains until um part two of Caves and Cliffs, this is really cool looking mountain generation, even if it is the old one. I haven't been able to find any goats yet. This is so weird. Goats are supposed to spawn, right? Like, they, they're in the snapshot. May Wait, maybe they're not able to spawn in this type of um biome because we'd already loaded it, so maybe we'll have to go further out for fervor further out before we finally find a goat because I actually went into a creative world and even that didn't have any goats but the goats can ram us off of a mountain so we'll have to be very careful let's just keep on going just keep on going wait actually that's a lot of eggs. That's a lot of eggs, nice. Well, I've just come face to face with quite the conundrum. I need to get back home. And I don't have a compass. I don't even have a single piece of redstone. This is bad. This is really bad, by the way. I am kind of in need for food, so let's just get a bunch of mutton. Sorry, sheep. I'm gonna have to kill some of you. Alrighty. Just continuing to knock the living heck out of every single one of them. Make sure th or by the time they're dead they don't know what up is from down or something like that. I don't really know. And yeah, you know what? I think we have enough. Nine. Yeah, that's, that's good. Alrighty. I remember we have the giant spawn pillar, so maybe that's something I should look out for. I mean, I feel like it'll be pretty easy to find it, considering we're about to go up a, a towering mountain. So, awesome. Also, in one of these episodes, I want to transform our base into an actual house. But at the same time, I also want to make our base more than just a base. I mean, make our house more than just a house, make it a base. Okay, already. Okay, this is going to take a while. My... Maybe I should just use this method. It works. It actually works. It's pretty effective too. Okay, with that done... Alrighty, this method is working. Water mountain climbing. I'll call this method the wet mountain climbing. <gasps> oh, yes, that's, that's really cool. I want to go on that floating island. One day, one of these days, I'll go on to there. Since I'm so high up, I'm just gonna crank this up to 32 chunks, just so I can see everything. It's gonna drop my frame rate exponentially, but at least I'll know where I am. Because finding where I am is my top priority. Ooh, I think I see some chunk errors. Let's look the other way. The 
That's definitely not home. But that is interesting. It looks like there's a chunk error. I need to see this. Let me just... You know. Okay, it's night, so I'm just keeping on clicking until I can finally lay down and put my head on the bed. 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 If you're wondering why there's all that water, that's because I've, um, yet again, wet mountain climbing. Except this time I was descending. I should probably, um, get out of that and see what the chunk error was about, because it's really interesting that something like this happened, but it also means that we're near, um, previously generated chunks. Oh my god, that is so cursed. But, no, what the good news is that I can find things like ores more easily. That is so cursed. Why does it have to be so cursed? That's so weird. Literally the weirdest thing I've ever seen in Minecraft. Anyway, now that that's out of the way, we know that we're beginning to hop into generated chunks. At least I think so. Uh, the generation there is looking pretty blocky. I'm not sure. I don't think we're getting any closer to home. If we are, great. If not, oh well. Because I don't have a compass. Yes, I am going to be doing this. It's as easy as collecting a $19 Fortnite card. Trust me, guys. I, I was being funny, by the way. Like, you expect me to be serious about that? I really do not want this episode to be composed of nothing but trying to find my home. Because if that was the episode, it would be even more boring than... Uh, what was that other one? I don't know. All of my episodes are boring. It's, it's kind of a fact. So that's why I tried to make some of them interesting, like trying to do some cool stuff, but it ends up... Oh, sorry. It ends up being boring in the end, so I accomplished nothing. Anyway, I'm just continuing to do everything. Finding my home in specific. And I think we might be getting close. I'm not really too sure, but... You know, it's worth a try. That is... scary. The fact that we're getting lava like this. And some of it turns into cobblestone. Away. Oh god, I almost just died. Actually, no, I wouldn't have died because, like, you know. Come on, I'm even finding llamas and I still can't find myself a goat. This is not only a hunt to find my house again, it's also a hunt to find a goat, which I thought I just saw, but. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure I was just seeing things. Just seeing things. Alrighty, let's go. Let's jump. And in this episode, it'd also be cool to make an enchanting table. I'm not really sure. Wait, I just realized the sugarcane texture looks a tiny bit different. I don't know why. I don't know why, but... Yeah. Bees? Bees are in the area? Bees! We found bees. I, 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 we found bees before we found goats. Like, what, what, what is this? That's so weird. Anyway, I'm just continuing to climb up, and holy god, that almost just. Oh no! No, 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 no! Please. Ah. Uh... There goes our water supply, boys. There goes our water supply. What are we gonna do now? We have to, like, find water on top of here? I'm not really sure. 
Oh no, oh dear lord. This is not going well. <sighs> if only I knew what coordinates I was at. Also, if only I knew where I could find some water. Not only am I thirsty, but I also don't want to take any more damage. Which is beginning to look like an impossible feat, so the best thing we can do is see if we can reach that. And luckily I have six, count to six, cobblestone. Uh, I just realized how hard this is going to be. Come on. Work. Yes. Alrighty. Awesome. We aren't dead meat. Anyway. I still need to find where my oh my god, can this get any more cursed? I've definitely never been there. I've never seen anything that looks like dark oak and oh That's it, I'm just gonna look it up on YouTube. I'm just gonna look up my coordinates, real quickly. I was looking, and I saw, n n um, negative 79, and wait one second, hold on. I'm just, sorry about my dog. Okay, so it was negative 79, 203. So I have to, have to go this way. It says negative 79. We're also going to have to go this way. Probably this way first. I see the sky is already getting pretty dark. Alrighty. There we go. Let's keep on going. We have quite a lot of traveling in the X direction, but not as much Y. So, okay. Let's keep on going. And running out of... Sorry about my dog, by the way. Did I, did I mention... Um... Wait. Wait a second. Hey, we found it! We're at our base! For a second, I was like, oh, we're at a jungle, but nope, we're, we're here. We, we made it home, boys! We made it home! And no, we did not find any um, goats. I wish we could, but we didn't. Anyway, I think today, I want to... I say, I don't know what I want to do today. How about we make this just like last, ju just like episode two, this will be no more than a mining episode. So, let's, uh, sorry. Let's go down into the mines and do this. Woo! But yeah, there's a lot of ore related changes that happened between 05 and 15 and I shall show you it once we get to our mine because it's actually a pretty significant change very significant actually so once you see it you'll never unsee it if you know what I mean anyway this is the one direction I haven't mined in yet so Wait, I've, I've only went in that direction before, so let's start a new mine. And this time, it, it won't be the same old mine we've been going down forever. We'll finally be going down a brand new mine, and there's a lot of... As you can see, we did not mine the usual copper blocks. Instead, we have 
raw copper. Yes, you heard me right. Raw copper. Which can actually be turned into a block. Which is pretty cool. How they made what they like to call a condensed version. And no, there's not a raw um, coal, but there is a raw iron. And iron's actually really important. It's cool to have iron. As you can see, there's also a raw iron. Because with the addition of um, deep slate ores, deep slate's another new thing, they um, had to make a deep slate version of the ores. So, you know what I mean, right? So, time to continue mining. And if we actually dig far enough, we'll actually be able to find those deep slate ores. Oh god, that's not good. Um, how did we get here? Like, I, uh, silverfish. We found silverfish. I don't know how this happened, but we found silverfish. That does not in any way mean that we're near a strong. Oh god, no, no! As I was saying. That does not mean we are near a stronghold. It's just something that happens in the world sometimes, I guess. Like, but I definitely did not see that coming. Definitely did not. And I'm pretty sure I found it, like, around here. Yeah. Where do the silverfish go? Do they just die? Wait. I didn't kill it in one shot, meaning I have to... Um... This fiend! This little fiend! This is so weird. I found a silverfish vein. Anyway, let's just go back to mining. Let's pretend that never happened. The only thing it will remain in is the XP I got. And also we found more iron, which is awesome. By the way, the point of these new ore textures is so people who are, say, colorblind can more easily identify these. Like, do you know how often people confuse diamond and lapis? Well, that's still gonna happen, because diamond ore texture never changed. So let's just keep on mining. Mine like nothing happened. And, my god, we found more iron, and I just realized our diamond pickaxe, it's running really low, and we don't have any diamonds we can use to replace it. We might have to run this one out, guys. We, we might have to sacrifice. Sacrifice for the gods. Anyway, let's just keep on doing this, keep on collecting all that raw iron. I mean, look at how much we have. We have 22! 22 raw iron. That is amazing. Let's just keep on mining forth. And for a second I thought I heard a cave, but nope. Just keep on doing our thing. Keep on doing our thing, and I'll, I'll tell you when we get to an ore. Yay, our first gold. That means we can get raw gold. Awesome. Raw gold or something. Oh, diamonds. They're still diamonds, as you can clearly see. They definitely look different, but they have the same general feel to it. So, that never changed. And yes, I am going to be making a new diamond pickaxe. But that also means I can make a diamond shovel, finally. So, anyway, we are just going to... Oh, we're near a cave. I'm just going to use out this specific pickaxe, and we'll be good. Anyway, I'll be flabber smacked if we haven't built it uh, mined outside of... Or area. So I'm anyway. I'm just gonna sleep. 
just gonna sleep right here and then we'll go back to mining awesome back to mining oh for a second I thought I saw gold or something but nope we're good more redstone you can't go wrong with more redstone especially if you got lost like I did so let's just keep on going and by the way what day am I on Tw day 23 nice it's actually pretty good Let's just place that. Keep on mining. Just awesome. Just awesome. I was going to make my base bigger in this episode, but I decided that just mining will be okay for me. Plus, it's it's a good way to show you the new features of the snapshots. Especially if I mine into... Um, unloaded chunks because if that happens then we'll really get to the good stuff anyway it looks like our diamond pickaxe is on end so we'll just use it as much as possible before it commits dead commits the dead because that's what happens nothing is immortal including Things that weren't alive in the first place. Yay! We found another emerald. Seriously. And I already said this was going to be like episode 2. But I didn't mean like that. <laughs> also. Iron. Only one though. So that's kind of disappointing. But like I said. It's going to be like episode 2. But I didn't mean that literally. Also, the fact that we found diamonds, like a small diamond vein, before we found our first emerald. And since we're basically completely surrounded by mountains, by the way, pickaxe broke. Since we're completely surrounded by mountains, it won't be very hard to find things like, like I was talking about, um, emeralds. Because emeralds aren't really that rare in mountain biomes, but they literally don't even exist beyond mountain biomes, so... Yeah. Anyway, I need to make more torches. It's just a good idea. And so we go... Oh, wow, I just found a cave. I just found a cave, and that's way too big. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna keep on mining by, and I can't even escape it. it. It came. I came to. I came to it by accident, but this time it came to me. Anyway, with that now done, I can just do that and do that. And we're oh, wow. That means I'll have to mine this way now. And I just found more emeralds! That's a, my second emerald this episode. If we find three, that means that this is basically just episode two. And, not to mention... You know what? Finding three emeralds, that is like episode two. However, it'd be insane if we also found... A nine vein of diamonds like episode two that would just uh, that would make my day I just love oh I don't like that noise so here zombies but also I'm just gonna real quickly make sure that this never happened. So now I can just continue on and pretend that that cave never existed. Awesome! Dang! I found some more ores, so I'm gonna have to be really careful so I don't have anything fall into lava or a cave. And a big cave at that. That's what I meant. That was lava right there. And. The best part, that's just a singular thing of lava, just out of nowhere, which makes this 
just kind of funny. Like, when you think of lava, you think of giant pools of lava, and not just a little blip. It's very funny. Just keep on mining. Also, I just, um, mined over a cave. Awesome. What are with all these caves? I know they called this the Caves and Cliffs update, but this is ridiculous. God! What? No. Uh. Oh. Oh, man. Maybe going this way would help. I, I have a feeling I'm just going to mine in one big square. It's just, it's just gonna basically be what happened. I would say a circle, but this is, this is not a game. Oh god, I just found my third emerald. Okay, now all I need is a nine vein, and it will be a complete repeat of episode two. So let's keep on going. And of course, I can't go in any direction without finding a thousand caves. So let's just go this way. Pray to God, pray to Notch. Actually, he's the Minecraft God. That this will hopefully go well. God, there were so many caves in the area. So many caves, I had to make so many twists and turns. It almost makes this a little bit. Oh my! Just, can this please stop? Just no more. I'm sorry, Iron, but I'm gonna have to skip over you for a little bit. I wonder where I'm finally gonna be able to go in one straight line without- Oh my god. This is- This is no- This is getting more and more annoying by the second. It's like, I- I just wanna be a- I just wanna be left alone. Jesus! Also, I have this. Uh, I have a feeling that that cobblestone is no ordinary cobblestone. Well, so I hear th there's a giant cave above us. Just do that. Have it go a little bit longer. There we go. Lay a torch. Lay another torch, actually, I meant to say. And we should be almost uh, completely away from the lava. At least I hope we are. Because this is beginning to kind of wreck my brain. How many caves we've gone through. Finally, we've escaped it. So now let's just do this. Real quickly. Although I do want to keep that open just in case. Nope, that's just our mine. Okay, nothing special. I just opened it just in case it was something special, but it's just our mine, so. What can I say? Also, I do not want a mine above me right there. That would probably be the most disastrous thing I've done all playthrough. Wait, just place another torch. And when we run out of torches, I'll just make a new batch. What, you thought I was going to say that we were going to stop mining? Well, no. We aren't going to stop mining, even though I have a gut feeling that maybe I should stop. It's getting to be mentally challenging, and that's never a good thing. It's never a good thing when you're playing Minecraft. How about we just... How? I thought it worked. Now I can just mine even more of the iron. 
O. There we go. And even more iron. This is so annoying. I wonder when I could finally get all of this iron uninterrupted. But I'm, yeah, I'm just gonna be using that method. It works exceptionally well. So, huh, that's weird, I found a fourth one. That means that we're still in the mountains, doing whatever. Wondering when, oh, we're, we're, I wonder when we're finally gonna be able to get out of the generated chunks and finally be in untamed territory. Because there has been a lot of changes, like I said, also to world generation, because, like, all this stuff is weird. You guys know what I mean, right? Y you know. Alrighty. Just gonna stop until we find a cave or whatever. By the way, I just wanna mention that I made some new torches. That's all. Excuse me? There's an axolotl where? No! The axolotl died! No! No, just, just no. Why? Oh, uh, I see why. Lava. Good old fashioned lava. Not even our new friend, the axolotl, can survive. But that was the only axolotl, so I'm just gonna leave this place in quite despair. Also, it's a giant cave. I do not want to be in a giant cave or even associate with one just no just no Here, let me just mine more iron because like there's a thousand bits of iron today i i don't know how iron is this common i thought it was rarer than just finding it every other step no even the bats are dying this is just Ah, oh, this is painful. All the cute mobs are just dropping like flies. Like, <laughs> what? I don't know why. Why are the why are the cute mobs dropping like flies? It's so weird. I'm getting so much iron. I have to have a second slot open for iron. Iron is especially common today. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it's in. Seriously, if I'm getting that much iron without fortune, imagine how much iron I'd be getting with the. Oh my god, that's a fifth. That's my fifth emerald! What? <laughs> ah, anyways, I was saying. Fortune actually works on iron, gold, and copper now. Oh my god, I just found more. <laughs> what is this? I just keep on finding more ore. Like, what? <laughs> How? Just that's a lot. How how am I finding this much? Uh, I'm just I I give up. This is this is too good luck. This is why I decided to go into a different path. Because look at how much ore I got. Anyway, let me just keep on going. Oh, I just gained a level. That's really nice. Just really nice. Guess what, guys? That's right! I hit another cave. Let's go this way. Um, that did not work. Let's... Instead, let's go the other way. Maybe... Um... I think I'm trapped. Unless, of course, I just... Aha! Uh -huh. I found a way around it! I knew I was good at this, and I found more gold, so that's also a nice thing. Fortunately, I hear a s unfortunately, I hear a skeleton. But, it's probably where we were before, so... With that collected, let's place a few more torches so everything's lit up. 
So everything's extra lit. Yeah, I know that phrase is dead, but don't... I don't even care. Just keep on going this way and hope that nothing happens. Hey, I found more gold! Seriously, iron and gold, and also copper, but whatever, are extremely common today. And the fact that redstone, which is usually as common as, like, coal, is somehow nowhere to be seen. I don't know how this happened. I also feel like I'm about to strike. Instead of striking even more gold, I'm probably gonna strike cave. But I hate cave. Like, I only go with the small caves that, like, can go all the way up and it doesn't converge into a bunch of other caves. But don't. That's what happens when you get these new types of caves. Anyway, hopefully, we should be out of the territory that. We have, um, generated chunks. We'll be able to generate some new chunks. So we can get some of those new blocks. Because the new blocks are probably awesome. Because I've never played survival in any of these... Sorry for that noise. I've never played survival in any of these snapshots. So this will be pretty new territory for me. Just keeping on mining good along. Keep on mining. Why did I feel like I just saw a name tag in a single player world? I don't know. There's probably just some No God Honestly, it's only when I'm recording where I really get to experience and like appreciate how smooth this game is when I'm not recording. It's so weird, but the frame rate actually drops while I'm recording. I don't know why. Also, because my frame rate is dropping this low, I'm going to guess that we're finally, finally near those new chunks. Also, that random cutoff with the, um, diorite? Never mind. Imagine if I started branch mining in one of these. That'd be kind of cool. And adjacent mining. That's also pretty effective, but... Alrighty. Also, I heard somewhere that diagonal mining is really effective, so... Maybe yeah, I'll try that. If you don't know what any of these methods are, I don't blame you. They're kind of out there. I just almost fell in lava again. Uh, that's... <laughs> Why are there so many emeralds? This is so weird. I keep on finding all of these emeralds. It's... It's an, it's absurd how many emeralds I'm able to find. This is officially the sixth emerald I've gotten today. Which... I'm refusing to be able to believe. And also, now that that's done, I can just keep on mining the- <gasps> We made it to the new chunks! As you can see, it, it sounds different when you break it. I thought that was a skeleton shooting at me. But, ladies and gentlemen, Deep Slate. This is Deep Slate. It's a really cool block. And I'm going to try to collect as much of it as possible. Because of it being a cool new block. There are also some other blocks that I can only find inside of caves, but it's okay. This is so cool! I love that we found a new block. It sounds so satisfying when you break it. I mean, just listen to that. It gives you a sense of oomph whenever you break it, which is always what you want from a block. Just keep 
on mining this. I'm mining it like an ore. But it's so plentiful that I can just keep on going. Like, they appear in big blobs like this, and that's really cool. I'm pretty sure I've run out of space for this. Yep. Run out of space. I'll mine more when I have room. But for now, let's keep on going. Keep on going. We're gonna keep on going until our pickaxe is at its knees. And by knees, I mean like it's dead. Because, like, we're gonna be doing a lot of mining. And, you know what? I'm beginning to get glad that we have so many furnaces. However, I feel like we might have to craft more. <laughs> Look at how much iron we have. Like, I've... Oh, uh, sorry. I, we've never had this much iron, ever. Like, ever. And I still do apologize for the phone ringing. But... The fact that you can even have this much iron is absurd. And this is without for fortune. If I ever get fortune 3, this is gonna be insane. So anyway, what's cool about this is that this we'll be able to play on like the full version when the summer update comes out. And we'll continue to be able to find new features. Oh, um, we, we dug into more of this stuff. Oh, I'm hearing both the skeleton and the deep slate. So I thought, I thought I heard a skeleton shoot again, but nope. It's actually both. Both heard the block break and, oh. Well, at least now we know which way we're going next. Alrighty, let's go this way, get more iron, seriously, like I said, the fact that you can get this much iron in a playthrough is obscene, how do you get this much iron, how, this is just, no, this is weird, very, very weird, just keep on, Digging this up. Yeah, this is coming. This is becoming boring. I'm just gonna stop. At this point, I'm not even going to stop recording when I find iron. As you can see, I just found more. But whenever I find iron, I'm not even gonna let you guys know. I'm just gonna continue on. If I find diamonds or another emerald. Then I'll let you know, cause like, those are the really good stuff that are actually rare. Keyword, actually rare. <laughs> I just can't. I just stumbled across another cave, and the worst part is that I see emeralds right there. But I can't. I can't, cause I'll get myself killed. I don't want to get myself killed, so... I'm not going to go in. Seriously. Caves are the bane of my existence. I don't know how people are ever brave enough to go in when you're in hardcore mode. If you die, you can't respawn. Also, I don't know why diamonds are so rare today. Like, they're literally nowhere. Quite literally. Imagine if I just... Oh, God. That was a close one. But that means that we're still in a mountain biome. I don't know how you can be in a single... Wait, we're in a river biome. Oh. Our precious gold! Like, I'm getting tired of iron, but gold? I... That's sad. So anyway, yeah. So... I... Sorry, one second. Sorry about that, my my dad was asking me a question about what I use. I use Bandicam, and I kinda don't like it. Oh, I just realized we have more iron here. I can't believe I skipped over that. Anyway, I should probably be careful, because my, my pickaxe is 
in a downward spiral. Only, like, only two more uses will render it just plain dead. I don't know what to say. It will be completely gone if I use it two more times, so I'm going to be going back home, storing that in a chest, and making a heck of a ton more furnaces. I'm going to need it. Okay, going back up, and just whoop, and doop, just keep on doing, th did I just hear an axolotl? Wow, that's pretty weird. Oh, wow, the sun's setting. Okay, alrighty. You know what? Guys, I think I'm just gonna, oh, <laughs> what just happened? Anyway, like I said, I'm just gonna make some, oh, that's right, I can make a bunch of blocks of this stuff. I can make 14 blocks of raw iron, that's how much I have. Wow, but like I said, I'm gonna make a bunch more furnaces. I'll definitely need it. <clears throat> oh, I do not want to make furnaces out of blackstone. Nope. <clears throat> Can I just real quickly... Okay, already. Hopefully, now it should... Oh my god. Can it just... <clears throat> I guess I'll have to do it manually. Wait, actually, I just realized I can just put this in a chest. Now it will work! Wait, that's another furnace. <laughs> What's working? What? 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 I, I mean... Sorry, guys. It's just weird. Anyway, that's gonna stay there. Um... Woo! Yeah, this is not working. See if we can. There we go. Yes. There. There we go. So now I can just boom and no. Dang it. Ugh. Boom and boom. So now I can just hop onto the bed, store this in a chest forever, and that looks so wrong. I don't know why. Just having a giant tower of that. It's there's something about it that's just it's not sitting well with me. That's eight coal right there, and I need another coal back into the mines. Of course, after I make myself an... Oh. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to chop down the tree. That tree's been there since day one, but I need it. I need the wood. No! Alrighty. And sticks. <clears throat> Alrighty, so back to the base. Alrighty. And now I can make myself the iron pickaxe. So I can go down and get a few more coal. That'd be very useful. Huh, there's been coal there this entire time. Several episodes of this playthrough, and <clears throat> never noticed that. Okay. Actually, I'm pretty sure I did, it's just that I forgot about it by the time episode 2 rolled around. <clears throat> uh, my voice is getting so scratchy. And, wait, 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 wait. There we go, let's go back. Let's go back. And, kaboom. Wait, I just opened the door. Okay. Better. Oh, by the way, there's something I wanted to do for a while. Let's real quickly grab one of my bamboo. Because, I mean, like, why not? First, I need to. Yes, okay, put, put some of that in there. I'm gonna need one bamboo. And I still have two oak leaves. Yes, this is perfect. I'm sorry, sapling, but you're not needed anymore. I just made a little tree. Oh, no. Um, that's just an alarm. That's just an alarm for something. Don't worry. I just made a little tree. That's very cute. I'm just gonna put that back in there. I can have this, right? Yeah, halved. And if I do some simple maths, I can learn I can just 
do that. And the raw copper, I don't really need copper. So back in there, and yeah, we're good. We're good. And we should probably put the emeralds away with the other ones. We have more than, we have over 10 emeralds. Wait, does that mean I can make, yes, yes I can. I have an emerald block. In fact, I'm going to start the treasure pile. And because I'm starting a treasure pile, that also means I'm going to need a block of gold and a block of iron. So let me just real quickly grab those. Wait, can I make a block of lapis? Do I even have lapis? Yeah, I have lapis. Okay. After this, this is going to be the end of the episode. I feel like this episode's been way too long. Okay, I think we're good, so... Yes. And, if you're wondering, the Eternal Blade of Grass, it's it's still alive. If, if it broke, it wouldn't have been eternal. So, anyway, I'm just going to end this episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, then be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.